we're here to talk to people about ticks really and just trying to raise awareness of the fact that during the summer tick numbers go up no bite is right basically so they don't actually have to have their dog bitten before they remove a tick they can there are certain things out there that means they don't have to have them bitten at all i'm a dog lover i've always had dogs and animals around me and i remember years ago when i used to walk the dog out on dartmoor having to actually remove ticks The tick bite itself can be unpleasant. You can get a sort of infection at the site of the bite, but they also carry particularly things like Lyme disease is one we're very concerned about. Lyme disease is just one of those diseases that, that ticks can transfer, um, not just to pets, but also to people as well. Um, it's a severely debilitating disease um, in people, and you hear stories about people that can, you know, become paralyzed from contracting it. So it's just really important not only to protect your pets, but also to protect your family as well. There are a range of other diseases that they can carry as well, including one called babesiosis that's just come into the UK from continental Europe, and we're very concerned about that. Babesiosis, with the particular species of babesia we're worried about, it just affects dogs, that doesn't affect humans. There are other species of babesia which can affect humans, but not the one that we get in dogs. When we've been up to Dartmoor, we, sometimes they come back with a tick. Cats get them all over the place, and even my old dog, she had one on hanging from her ear, like an earring. It looked like a, actually a skin grove of some sort. I know there's a possibility that maybe my family or I could get bitten by a tick. The risk mainly for the humans is when you walk the dog, you're taking the dog out to sort of country areas, to areas where there are ticks. That's the main ex route of exposure for people with their dogs. The first port of call is going to be your vet. You know, he knows about the particular issues in your area. Um, and then there's a tremendous amount of information on the web as well. Uh, it'sajungle.co.uk, fantastic website, gives you lots of fantastic information.